take up thy cross and follow me. You know, over in Matthew and in Luke in the Bible, it talks about how Jesus said that just that, take up thy cross and follow me. What does that mean to you? Let's talk about that today on your morning cup of inspiration. I look at take up thy cross and follow me as a couple different things. The cross, of course, represents the crucifixion, represents death. It's uh, Christ was carrying that cross. It was a burden for him. And then death, out of death became, came salvation. So I see the cross as, as salvation. But I look at it, I'm thinking, you know, take up thy cross and follow me. I don't think it's about carrying your burdens. You've got to care, put a bear, burdens on your shoulders and, and follow the Lord with these burdens. I don't, I don't think it's that. I really believe he's saying, when you accept me, you, you, you have the cross. You get the cross. And you take that cross with you until your final resting place here on earth. Which the cross is usually as a grave marker. It's been used for that. So you take your cross with you. But you live your life for Jesus. You spend your time encouraging others, inspiring others to have a personal relationship with Jesus. Just as you're doing by accepting Christ in your life and having your relationship and praying daily. Meditating on the word, reading the word. This is what Christ wants us to do. This is what Jesus spoke about. And I really believe that taking up my cross and following him is taking my salvation with me right to the end. You know, we don't know how long we have on this earth. We could be here today and gone tomorrow. But we take the cross with us wherever we go. We are representing Christ in our life. We are a representation of him and his salvation. So do that daily. Take up your cross and follow him. Don't look at the cross as a burden. Look at it as a joy. It's your salvation. And you're going to have eternity. Once your life is done on this earth, you have eternity with, with the Lord in heaven. All right? I hope you have a wonderful day, and I look forward to seeing you again for another morning cup of inspiration. God bless you all, and have a wonderful day.